What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Ultra Moon walkthrough. Yeah, it has been a while, and I gotta put this out a little because I can hear myself. Still working on that. Anywho. Yeah, um... Before we start anything, guys, <laughs> about a week or two ago, uh, a, a group of people found out about this secret identity and all that stuff. And it would turn out that, uh, yeah, they've known about it for two years. They just failed to tell me this. Yes, I'm talking about the football team I coach. So I'm looking at you guys. Uh, it was only a matter of time. I did this to myself. Anywho. All fun and games. Let's continue our adventure right here. Let's uh, <laughs> let's go ahead and uh, continue our adventure right here through the Aloyal region in Ultra Moon. If you guys remember, in the last episode, we actually went through the trainer school. We got beat three times. And I got an earful. A lot. Yeah. And, uh, well, we're not going to do that right here. No, not right here. And, well, we're going to be continuing our tutorial adventure right here in Haoli City, the beachfront. And as you guys can see, our good old buddy, uh, Hao, I think that's what his name is, he's just waiting for us. Look at the, vi the view, everybody right there, the tourists, and then the Slowpoke. I think Slowpoke has an Alolan form? Do they? Do they have an Alolan form? So here we have Hao, and he's like, beach time, yeah! Okay, and somebody notices us, he's like, hey you! You've come to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. Well, uh, we came from the Kanto region. We destroyed everybody. And uh, she's gonna be like, then let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola! Give it a try too, just like that. Alola. You'll make more friends if you say it. Alola, guys. Yeah, that includes you guys. You know who you are. Anywho, let's go ahead and continue on right here. And well, our navigator here says, holy, so big, let's try and walk around. Okay, so we're going to be walking around this whole area right here. It seems like we're going to be doing more tutorials, or maybe this is the last episode for a tutorial. I could be wrong. I mean, it's been a minute since I've played this game. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead and go straight to the beachfront. As you guys can see, we got a whole bunch of sunbathers just right here, and we're going to be grabbing some items. Make sure to grab those items, guys, because... Definitely going to be needing them early on, and, well, this guy right here is like, the wing will fly and they're dropping his fall. <laughs> the beauty of nature. Yeah, uh, I went to a school where the, the, what was it, the lunch bell, the break bell, was those seagulls' way of saying, hey, it's time to grab food, and they flew around and a bunch of people got a dookie in their face. You know who you are, too. <laughs> I remember those times. So, let's go right here. Maybe we're going to find an item. I don't know. Maybe. So, let's see. Ah, here we have a Pokemon. And this guy is Pew. I do not know what Pokemon that is. And, uh, well, we're going to be hearing some of these Pokemon trainers talk. Look, catch! Would you stop? I know they're squishy, but there's no reason to throw a Pew Pew Miyuku at me. Throw a Pokeball if you, want, if you must throw something. A Pew Pew Miyuku. These Pokemon names are, 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 are way different. Now, if you talk to her, she's going to be like, Slowpoke really has its own tempo, huh? It never confu It's never confused by other Pokemon's moves. It's too slow to get confused or to take a hint. Leave me alone already, would you, Slowpoke? Huh. That that makes a whole lot of sense. Maybe I have my own, my own tempo, too, because that happens to me quite a few times and all that crud. And, well, let's see. We're going to be finding some items. No items. And, uh, well, as you guys can see... Yes, it is a very, very big place right here in uh, whatever, wherever the heck we are. And if you go even further, you're going to be finding yourself your next destination. And it would happen to be this guy right here, I think. Let's see, if you talk to this guy, he's like, I feel like, uh, or I felt like there was something hiding behind the wall and laid right into the uh, karate chop. After all, karate chop makes it easier to deal a real devastating critical hit. Ah, that is true. And if you go right here... Well, you're going to be taking pictures, henceforth the whole uh, premise to Pokemon Snap 2. And, well, how is calling uh, calling for us right here? And he's going to be like, so what do you think? How will he is something, eh? Alola's got to gotta be the best place to ever live. Oh, oh yeah. Hey, Draven, come in here with me. I've got a good idea uh, for, of something you can do. Well, let's see what this guy has. 
he's probably one of the most level-headed guys that we've met so far. And, well, if you talk to this lady right here, she's going to be like, hey, or how is going to be like, hey, miss, is it true that you can uh, get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? My goodness, you get the good, uh, you get the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex, but it is true that we have a special item to go with it. It's our very own Pokey Finder. Here you go. And, uh, well, awesome. We're getting uh, some Pokey Finders, I guess. So, like, what's a Poke Finder? The Poke Finder is a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Rotom will uh, help you out in, a, in places where you will be able to take Pokemon uh, photos. Here, I'll read the instruction manual. Like, see, tap on a Rotom and press the R button. Yup, that's all it says. Quite simple, isn't it? It, it really is. And, uh, well, how's it gonna be like, man, that Rotom Dex is cool. It's like a whole nother partner, Draven. I mean, on top of your Pokemon partner. Oh, but I, I guess it's since uh, Rotom's inside, it's pretty much a Pokemon partner. It is. Not much of a Pokemon because, well, yeah. Either way, you're darn lucky. Meet you, meet you outside when you're done in here. Mm. Okay, so, let's see. The photos you can snap a Pokemon with a Pokefinder, they're simply the cute, uh, too cute to resist. They are. So, Rotom is happy. He's got himself a Pokefinder, and after you do that, we're going to be introduced to the whole Pokefinder deal. And here we have Lily. And she's going to be like, Draven, how? Did you visit the Tours Bureau? How was it? We got this Rotom Dex upgraded. Now it can take pictures, too. What a wonderful helper you are, Rotom. And, well, look at that. Rotom comes out, and he's taking pictures of all of us. And, well, he's like, huh. <laughs> what was that for Rotom? Go and put a little trickster back in your bag, Draven, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time we take care of our stomachs. Oh, we're gonna eat. We all know how much we like to eat, right? Maybe Rotom wanted to get your attention because it wants you to take pictures with you. Um, if you, if you, if, uh, or better yet, can't even read again. I think I'll go and stop uh, by the apparel shop to do some shopping on my own. Okay. We're gonna be doing some shopping. We're gonna be doing some stuff. And, uh, yo, trainer, look what you've got. Well, it's this guy right here again. He's like, you lucky kid, if you got a Poke Finder, then I guess I'll have to give you a little tip. I, I don't want no more tips. I just want to go battle Pokemon trainers. See the spot where the wall is cracked? That's a photo spot right there. Oh. Look, uh, look at that. Your Rotom, your Rotom there is trying to tell you, too. Give him a tap. Okay, so... I guess we're gonna have to do this. So you go right here, we're gonna tap onto the Rotom, and you're gonna press the R button right there. Now, afterwards, Rotom's gonna appear, he's gonna try and take pictures. As you guys can see, there is a female Pikachu right there. You can use the circle pads to move around and all that stuff. Press the button, take a photo and all that stuff, and uh, yeah, okay, so as you guys can see, boom, took a picture, we've got this again and if we move it again and i think if you i think the options do appear later on once you get more points but there you go again there you go yes pikachu yes and let's give it one more and bam there you go so after doing all that what kind of photo do you want to shake uh, i'll take the last one because i feel like that was the best one and yes and yes, we have been uploaded. And as you can see, we got more Pokemon trainers like commenting on our stuff right here. And we got quite a few thumbs up. And I am getting more text messages by the minute. Holy buckets. Not really. Okay, nobody cares. And uh, yes, we got 721 thumbs up. It's a bunch of thumbs up right there. And well, after that, let's go ahead and close the Pokefinder because I have no interest in Pokemon pictures right here right now. None whatsoever new so after that this guy right here is like i hear the it's best to try to photograph pokemon head on zoomed in as close as possible if you want to know more about the poke finder well just keep on taking tons of pictures we will eventually well, let us move on like the more we try to move on it, it, it it's, it's it's kind of difficult so let's go ahead and take a look at this area right here and i think We've already came out of this place. Yeah, never mind. Never mind. Okay. Alrighty. What do you think of the Poke Finder? Yeah. Okay, yes. I'm going to press that. Yes. Yeah, I'm not going to use it ever again. Unless it's mandatory or something like that. And as you guys can see, there is something shiny right there. 
And, well, Lily is waiting for us. And she's gonna be like, oh, Draven, tell me, do you pick all, uh, all, like, do you pick out all your clothes? Of course I do. I'm a big boy. Of course, most people uh, do, don't they? I, I, I've always just worn the clothes that my uh, mother wanted me to wear. I don't really know how, or I, I really don't know what kind of a uh, thing would suit me. Oh, but that's not uh, why I stopped you. I meant to give you this, Draven. I received it inside of the apparel shop here. I didn't even uh, buy anything, but they say I was the 99,999th customer to this store, but I already have the same one, so I thought that maybe you'd, uh, you'd want it. And what did we get? A lens case. I think it's for, yeah, those, those things right there. And uh, it looks like we have something in common now, don't we, Draven? Probably. Now, there is something shiny right here. It's a sparkling sticker. Something good may happen if you uh, remember this later on. Okay, so... If you guys remember, I know that it was briefly played, but in Pokemon Sun and Moon, it was kind of like the continuation of Giratina. No, not Giratina. Uh, Zygarde. My bad. And uh, its cells were all over the whole uh, region and all that stuff. And I'm assuming that this right here is a replacement for the whole Zygarde event and all that crud. So let's go right ahead and see what we can buy. I'm pretty sure we can't buy anything right now. We are poor. Poor AF. And, uh, well, talk to this lady. Welcome! And, well, every stage has its, uh, its beginning. As you guys can see, we got ourselves some shirts. You know, Hawaiian shirts and all that stuff. I remember back in middle school, that was kind of my thing right there. Hawaiian shirts. I don't know why. That's... And then we got tank tops now. Yes. We should probably go with a tank top. A black tank top is probably good. Green. Blue. Blue. Uh, navy blue. I'm going to go with navy blue. Yes. That actually fits us. And plain tee. We got some shirts right here. Your boy Draven likes his, uh, his, his uh, what was it called? His tank tops right there. And, uh, well, it looks like to us... Wow, surfing tank, collegiate tank, Alola C tank, casual striped tee. Oh, look at that. Okay, so we, 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 we have a good selection. I'm going to go with the regular one. To start off, we can go with pants, capri pants. Who, who, who wears pants there now? It's been a while since I've worn pants. And, wow, those pants are nasty. Okay, so let's go. Huh. Let's see, more pants. Okay, so they're only selling pants right now. I have no interest in pants. And we got socks. Okay, socks are pretty cool right there. No shoes available. But we can buy ourselves some hats. And, uh, yeah, we're not going to go with hats. And, no, I wear nothing. Uh, would you like to put on your... No, not right now. Eventually. I like to collect some of these uh, clothes and then actually get a, a, a good variety of this. And, uh, well, that's one thing. That's one thing you can do right here. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead and continue on our adventure right here. So from what it looks like, the red flag isn't too isn't too far away from here. But this right here is, I want to say, is a... Oh, it's a haircut place. Okay. We're not going to do this right now because, uh, yeah, I like my hair all shaggy in the game. And, uh, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to be moving this a little further on, okay? I know exactly what we need to do. But we're going to, we're going to do all kind of modifications later on in our game right here, guys. Now, if you guys can see right here, you guys can go straight towards the grass and pick up some items, which I'm going to try and do. And, uh, yeah, you'll be amazed at how many Pokemon you can actually find right here. Some of you guys are saying, maybe you should add uh, Magneto to the team because look what happened in the last episode. Yeah, that ain't happening. So, let's go with Zerlina. Making her appearance yet again. And, uh, well, let's go ahead and, 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 and train some of our Pokemon, you know, just to get strong and all that crud. And so far, we're getting paralyzed because, well, your boy is getting paralyzed every single time. Okay, so here we go. Let's do it again. Ember attack for the win. And Zerlina is kick is getting her butt kicked. So here we go. And just like that, Magnemite has been defeated. And we're going to press that Y button just to care for our Pokemon. And just like that, our Pokemon are getting some experience points. Aaliyah getting some points too. And, well, when this happens, guys, paralysis and poisoning... 
you can actually use this little item right here and rub it all over your Pokemon. That actually saves you the trouble of using a paralysis heal if you don't have it. And it makes your Pokemon loves you a little bit more. So let's go ahead and there you go. It loves me. So we're going to conserve all those beans until later on. And uh, we're going to move straight on forward to the next little uh, little spot that we, we like to go. And well, look at that. We found ourselves an item. It is a tiny mushroom. I believe you can sell those for a high price. And there is a Pokeball right there looking at me. Dead in my eye. And I want it. And if you guys don't know, there are... There are many Pokemon centers right here. Now, we're noticing this person with a sticker and uh, Emia or Limia or whatever you know, like to call it. Greetings, Captain Emia here. So you spotted me sticking one of uh, these lovely stickers, have you? Uh, that's a sticker, huh? Oh yes. If young trial goers go and collect these stickers as they travel and follow the path they indicate, they will quite naturally progress along their island challenge. Really, if I had to describe them, I would say these stickers really have saved. Uh, save trial goers so as you guys can see this is kind of like a lead to where to go and all that crud but i cannot let my guard down those team skull thugs have uh, far too much time on their hands and they have always been trying to get in my way of trainers in, in the, on their island challenge i have to keep an eye out on them be, and be sure to, uh, that they don't take down my stickers i've actually just had a report that team skull was uh make, was uh seen making trouble around the town i suppose i should go and have a look well then, young Draven, I hope you'll have a delightful time running uh, about the search and collect them totem stickers. Okay, so... Okay, so we just peeled it off, and we know where two more stickers are. Now, let's go right ahead and grab ourselves another Pokemon item right here. And hopefully not battle another Pokemon. Or battle Pokemon. You know, we need the experience points, guys. And would you look at that. We are battling a Furfro. Whoa, what is this? Ha! I've never seen that before. Okay, so... That was cool. That was cool, and I am going to continue battling right here because I've never seen that before. Again, guys, this is the first time I'm playing this game. And Furfrow is tough. This Poodle Oodle is about to get oodled. Okay, so here we go. Zerlina. That's right, Ember Attack. And, wow, this Furfrow is... Giving us the business right now. Here we go. Ember attack. Come on. Sand attack. Trying to make us... Oh, come on. You know what? Just for that, I'm going to capture you. With a great ball. So, here we go. Great ball. Let's go. And... There we go, guys. I'm throwing out the peace sign. Yes. That's right. Okay, so... Furfrow has been captured. And we're going to care for this Pokemon because, well, yeah, we need it to love us. And, well, let's see. Furfrow is going into the Pokedex. And from what we're looking at right here, it is a uh, very nice, majestic AF, AF Pokemon. And as you guys can see, left alone, its fur will grow longer and longer. But if you only, uh, but it will only allow someone it trusts to cut it. So we got to get it to love us. And, yes, we're not going to make this guy whatever you know trust us or whatever and we got to wipe up our pokemon because we got dusted off oh that's not the right one and oh okay okay there we go we are brushing it brushing it brushing it brushing it and there you go loving us already there you go. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now, guys, is I'm going to be back real quick. Time limit is coming up right in, right about now. Okay, so we're back, guys. Wow. Uh, always charge your batteries. I'm telling you that right now, guys, if you want to be a future tuber, or a future YouTuber, I should say, because, well, shoot. Yeah, I was kind of, like, dashing around for, like, uh, for extra batteries and all that stuff, and, yeah. Yeah, gotta have your extra batteries just in case, guys, you uh, want to do all that stuff. So, let us continue on right here. And, uh, hopefully, yep, we didn't get attacked by anybody else. And, uh, well, let's see. Anything else right here? Oh, you know what? Let's go straight into the Pokemon Center. I'm gonna take another break right here, so I'll be right back with you guys.
Okay, we're back guys, and you know what? Off screen, I did grab two more Pokemon out of the Pokemon Center because it looks like we're gonna be needing some of these guys just in case, uh, yeah, we just in case we run into a little bit of an issue. Because remember, we got two Pokemon, not the best typings right now, and we're gonna grab this, and as you guys can see, we're gonna find ourselves an Aether, which is always great. And that looks like a sticker, yes. Oh, we need a fishing rod! That is not fair. But we're finding another sticker right here. Two totem stickers. I wonder how many totem stickers there'll be. And, uh, well, let's see. Moving on forward. Looking all over the place. Excuse me while I grab the totem tick, the totem stickers. Uh, yeah. Pokemon refresh. And we're going to be moving forward right here. And as you guys can see, we found ourselves another totem sticker. And we can't reach that. But you know what? Let's go inside right here and see what this is all about. And, uh, wow, there's some Machamp in there, and, uh, oh my, it looks like our Berry Stark is getting a bit low. I better put another order in delivery for the Berry Fields. So, nothing right here. I guess they're Berry, Berry guys and all that stuff. I would have to say, talk to this guy, and nothing. Okay, so, let's see. Maybe if we talk to a few people, see if we can grab some, like, items and all that stuff, probably. This is Town Hall, that's a Pokey Pew Pew Pew. Kimuki, I can't even pronounce that name. If you talk to this guy, let's see. Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay. How about her? Ribbons. And, oh, look at that. We found ourselves a sticker. And, wow, these stickers are going to be all over the place. I'm not going to, wow. I'm going to have to keep track of all these things right here. So, there's that. And it looks like we're going to have to cross this area right here. And, look at that. We got four of those little suckers right now. And let's see. If we go right here. Wet paint. Okay, so there's a smear go over there. And how is letting us know that, hey, I'm right here, homeboy. And he's like. Plus, Ma Malasa does make your Pokemon like you, and affectionate Pokemon are better in battle. They are. Who can resist their Pokemon a few Malasa does? And they're just so cute. Yo, 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 check it out. Whenever you're, uh, wherever we meet you, Team Skull don't even greet you. What? Okay, so, it's looking like we got some Team Skull people. They're like, yo, you want to go, you want to throw us a bone and hand over those Island Challenge amulets you, uh, to us now? Oh, so you're part of Team Skull, huh? All you guys ever do is steal po uh, totem stickers in people's Pokemon and get, a get in the way of other people's Island Challenges. You know it. We hate uh, we hate the island challenge, yo. And every uh, kid full uh, every kid full enough to try it. Why are they doing this? They're doing that. I I wow. Well, okay, you let the uh, let the okay. Yeah, you know what? We're just gonna battle. Yeah, we're gonna battle them. All right, uh, let's go. Let's do it. Uh, maximum effort. Yeah, they're just doing. I, I, I don't know. They're probably doing for a rave. They think they're rappers or something. And here it is, guys. Our very first battle against Team Skull members. And this guy's like, you are challenged. So here he goes. Comes out with a Zubat. All right, Zubat. Bring it. Here comes Zerlina. And, uh, yeah, this, this Meow Meow Cat Cat is going to burn this Pokemon to the ground. So here we go. Ember attack. And that takes a, a oh yeah, a, 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 a bunch of uh, HP right there. I almost said something that I shouldn't have. <laughs> and we are confused, so let's go right ahead. Press that B, come on. Oh, come on, Zerlina. And here comes an Astonish attack. You gotta love these Pokemon who confuse you, so let's go, Ember attack. Come on, Zerlina. There we go, burn attack. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's how it feels. Okay, so that right there gives us experience points, and Team Grunts or Team Skull has been defeated. Okay, so let's see. No fair! I was playing a different game. Let's get up out of uh, Port B. Nobody has to know to uh, know about this. We don't need your whack little amulets anyway. Wouldn't even take them if you gave them to us. Those team skull jerks really must uh, must uh, much have too much time on their times. Are they hands? Yeah. 
But keeping other Pokemon or people from uh, their island challenges isn't going to make it uh, like they managed to finish theirs, you know? I already went down uh, to Marina and screamed out over the ocean, Watch out, world! Someday I'm going to beat even my old Gramps in an all-out serious battle. So maybe I'll go and try and find some more totem stickers next. See you around! And Emma is going to be like, what a lovely battle do you show us there against Team Skull? My thanks to you and your Pokemon. Why don't you, why don't I heal your Pokemon to express my gratitude? And yes, we're going to get healed. Yes. Okay, and uh, I must admit, I've been wondering about you since I saw you at the trainer school. Professor Kakui brought you along and you and your Pokemon seem to defeat our teachers so effortlessly. Very well then, allow me to see if you're ready for my trial. Sure, let's go right ahead. Behold, the magnificent Pokemon of the one and only Captain Ima. Okay, so here it is. Let's do it. They kept this song. Okay, let's do it. They should have kept this song the whole entire time. So here we are, guys, taking on Captain Ima, and she's going to be coming out with Donald Trump, I mean, uh, Yangoose. And here we go with Zerlina. Okay, so let's go. Let's do it. Ember attack. For the win. There we go, Zernia. And uh, here comes a tackle attack. That right there gives us a little bit of a hit. So let's go. Straight for another Amber attack. There you go. And here comes a Leer attack. So that right there is going to lower our defense just a tad. And let's go with a workup attack. This right here will increase both our special and our physical attack. And yes, okay, bring on the tackle. Bring it oh crud baskets. Okay, so we really need to, <laughs> we really need to defeat this Pokemon. So here we go. Zerlina. Ember attack. And just like that, Donald Trump has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. And Zerlina grows to level 14. Look at you. And she is learning Fire Fang. This is a much better attack. Kinda. So let's go ahead and switch scratch for it. Yeah, I know it's two fire type attacks, but one's physical, one's special. It's a good, uh, it's a good move right there. And Slowpoke grows to level eight, just in case. And here comes Schmirgle. Schmirgle. Let's go with Aaliyah. Okay. Now, my baby girl's watching this. If, she told me if this Pokemon faints, she will smack me upside the head. I don't know. And should I be afraid? I don't know. So, let's go right ahead and go with a sweet kiss attack right here. And here comes a tackle attack. I forget that Aaliyah is... Oh, my God. Never mind. Okay, so let's switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with Magneto. It is a Steel-type Pokemon, so physical attacks won't work that much. We're just kind of worried that, you know, this Pokemon might have a trick up his sleeve. And here comes a tackle attack. Not so effective. Alrighty. Payback time. Thunder Wave attack. Let's go, Magneto. Ah. I, 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 I am grateful that I... Oh, man. Okay. So, there we go. You are paralyzed, my friend. Now, we got the benefit of uh, hurting you. Okay. Here we go. Thunder Shock. Come on. How in that? Okay. You're cured of paralysis. Come on. Okay. She couldn't have more than one full heal, right? So here comes a water gun attack. And that right there will get us. So here we go. Thunder wave attack yet again. Alrighty. That's right. That's right. You stay paralyzed, my friend. Okay. Thundershock, come on. Oh, come on. How are you faster than us? Well, we did our job right here. We need to build up our team, so let's go straight for Slowpoke, because it is a water-type Pokemon. Downside is it is slow. It sends hence the name right there. Um, yeah, we're going to have to go with a Tackle Attack right here. We got no choice. And thank God this Pokemon is beefy. Okay. So there might be a little bit of strategy. Bag. Potion. And... We're going to have to give that to Zerlina. Okay, so here we go. Another tackle attack. Let's go, Slowpoke. Alrighty. Let's go right here. You are paralyzed. Yes! Okay, here we go. Slowpoke. 
do your thing. Look at you. And we do have Furfro. Turns out that it has a pretty good uh, attack. So here we go. Tackle attack yet again. Come on, Slowpoke. You can do it. Hmm. Curse attack. I have a feeling. There we go. Curse. Alrighty. Lowering our speed just a bit. And yes, our attack and defense has risen. This game is uh, looking like a strategic game for me. So it looks like I have to be a strategic magic. And there we go. And come on. Yes, okay, alrighty. Let's get it. Tackle attack for the win, I think. And the most we're going to get off is just one hit. There we go. Hopefully one hit. Okay. Wow. Yeah, we're chopping this Pokemon down, and here comes another tackle attack. Let's go, Slowpoke. Do it. Wow. Who'd ever, say, who'd ever thought that we might win with a Slowpoke on our team? That's never happened. Okay, come on. We need a crit. We need something. Pokemon gods, help me out. And a tackle attack. And there goes Slowpoke. Okay. Let's go, Furfrow. Let's get your French on. All right? Let's get your French on. Sacre bleu. All right, here. And a tackle attack. Okay. I know we have to be strategic about this whole thing, but I kind of want to just go on the offensive and... Oh, nearly beats him. Okay. If she comes out with another potion, he, she comes out with another potion, I'm going to be mad. And no. We win. Jerica. Alrighty. That's how you do it. And we are going to care for our Pokemon. And just like that, Furfrow grows to level 10. And Aaliyah grows to level 12. Yes. And we have defeated this guy right here. Or girl. I don't even know. I'm confused, guys. Comment down below. And, well, this Pokemon is uh, not fluffy anymore. We're going to have to brush its, uh, its stuff. So there you go. Just for your victory, we're going to brush your thing and then hopefully make you into a nice poodle oodle. The thing is, guys, each time you put this Pokemon back into the PC, its hair grows back. So, yeah. Alrighty. Thank you, for Frau, for being a, a tank, I guess. Alrighty. So after that... This person, um, whatever gender it may be, you, or should I say, you and your Pokemon make quite an interesting team. I do hope you'll come to Verdant Cavern and attempt the trial, uh, the trial of Iyama. You can do, you can get there at Route 2. The Rotom Dex is yours to show you the way. I bid you Alola. Deuces. Deuces. Anywho. So, we beat the captain, and, well, that right there will be our episode. I know it's not that long. Well, yeah, it's been a little long right here. But, yes, finally we're back, and uh, we're going to continue doing this. I have realized that three episodes for a week is going to be a little difficult for me to use, uh, to do, guys. So it's going to be twice a week, long episodes, and uh, from there, just let's hope we can finish this game on time and all that crud. So thank you guys again for being uh, very patient with me. Thank you guys uh, for being supportive. And... Uh, Boys, thank you for watching my episodes. I see what you guys are doing. You know the deal. I do love you guys. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode as we continue right here in the Alola region. See you guys.